Welcome to another quick live stream here in Akihabara. We're at uh, the local Hard Off, checking out uh, some retro video games here. Uh, they have a few uh, Mega Drive loose games, Sonic and Tails, about 1,100 yen. They've got Shogi Star, not too exciting. Shining Darkness, also for 1,100. What is that? Sun Kuni, I can't, the Genghis Khan game, I believe. I've got Lethal Enforcers with the uh, instruction manual for about 1650. What else do they have back in there? Some more Famicom games, golf, and just star not so good. Uh, some uh, Famicom, Donkey Kong 2, Hattori Kun, Shanghai, Argus. Nothing too exciting. Rockman X. 2200 seems a little steep. Rockman X there. I got the Great Battle. Aratanaru Tatakai, something like that. I got Rockman X2 for about 1100 yen there too. This Shogi no Hana Michi. Another Shogi game with Sakura. It's a pretty cool little thing there. Final Fight, classic beat em up there, 1100 yen as well. Toruneko no Daiboken, I believe that's a spin off. I'm not exactly sure what that is. Got some Momotaro. Oh, we have Chomakai Mura here for 1100 yen. We got uh, Hoshino Kirby 3. Uh, 1,600. That's not a bad deal, actually, for that. Good one. Good curvy game. Uh, Gyrodyne for the original Famicom. Some Kunio Kun soccer there. Rockman 5 for about 1,100 yen. The SD Gundam Sumo game. 500. And I can never remember this game. Interesting. By anime, by Pony Canyon, it's called Kujaku O. The title is definitely different in English, but it loosely translates to Peacock Prince, I think. We've got Hinotori, which is an interesting uh, early platformer on the Famicom. Pretty cool little uh, action platformer. I believe it's an anime by uh, Tezuka Osamu, if I'm not mistaken. Alright. We got Saint Tosea. 500 yen game there. It is a fan classic. Looking very scruffy looking here. Uh, Boku Dracula Kun. Akuma Joe Dracula, the cutesy version. Really good game. This one is really scruffed up. 22 bucks. I don't know if it's worth 22 bucks in that condition. Maybe it is. You guys let me know. What do you think? We got Transformers over here. 1100 yen. Mystery of Convoy. Not not a great shooter at all. Oh, we got another uh, Makai Muda for the Famicom. 1100 yen for that. We got Bug Stay Honey, which is also a cool little platformer. 2200 yen for that. Yes. That's probably a classic uh, Japanese Famicom game, which is why it's kind of expensive here. There's the original uh, Boken Jima, Takashima Meiji no, the first one in the series there. Alright, let's spin around and take a look at uh, some of the games over here. We have a large variety of Switch. Super Famicom in the box. And some Wii U games too. That's a random Mega Drive game. 
Master of Monsters. I'm not familiar with it, but the artwork looks really cool. Um, it's like a strategy game. Not one of my favorite types of games for sure. We have Yoshi's Island for 1100 Aladdin, 2750 The box is pretty mangled. But they got it. We got Pop and Twinby here, which is a great shooter. The box is in really bad shape for 2,200 yen. It also says there's no manual in there. Super Mario RPG back there. Pachinko, here's the uh, Takahashi Meijin Daiboken Jima here. Pro Wrestling, Dragon Quest 1 and 2 in a really, really scruffy box there. We got Dragon Quest 6 in a much better looking box, definitely. Oh, and here is uh, Tetris Gaiden. 1,100 yen for that. It's supposed to be a pretty good uh, Tetris, has some cute uh, anime characters in it animations and sprites and things. It's a pretty good deal for that. Bomberman 2. Super Bomberman 2. Super Wangyan Land. Othello. Nothing too exciting. Uh, we got... Uh, Daiboken. Tokyo Disneyland Daiboken. Tokyo Disneyland's Adventure, Mickey Adventure here. A nostalgic one for Tokyo Disneyland goers. All right. So we've got uh, Sonic and Tails here for twenty-seven fifty in the box. Nice shape. Clamshell looks good. An interesting uh, PlayStation Sakura Taisen Monogatari Final Fantasy Collection here. 1650. That Dynamite KG2 for the Dreamcast. 4,400 yen. It's supposed to be a really good one. Also, what else we got? Capcom vs. SNK Millennium Fight 2000. 800 yen for that. That's not a bad deal. Shenmue in there. Sakura Wars. Biohazard Value Plus. 1650 for that. This thing is poking out. What is this? We've got Parodius Da. Kyokujo Deluxe Pack for the PlayStation. This is pretty tempting. I do like Parodius, and it's the Deluxe Pack. I don't have this for the PlayStation. And I've been kinda getting into PlayStation recently. What's this here? This is for the Saturn Steam Gear Mash. This one I've never played before. It's about 2,700. Doesn't have the manual. Just this much of the box and jewel case. Also got uh, Gradius Gaiden for 3,300. That's pretty cool. I just bought Gradius 3 and 4 for the PlayStation 2, which is really a lot of fun. I haven't really got to play it much, but it's really good so far. But this also looks cool. I've never come across this one before. Radius Gaiden. There's another one that caught my eye. Sonic Wings Special Stage, I think it's called. Sonic Wings Special. 4,400 for that. It says arcade on it. 
arcade hits. This is also supposed to be pretty good. There's some pretty good stuff, like poking out at random places here. It's a bunch of DS games. Xbox One, they've got uh, Battlefront 680. If I had an Xbox, I would buy that, definitely. It's a Street Fighter here from the PS4. 49.50 Check out what they have in the glass. They've got uh, JoJo's for 27.50. That's for the PlayStation. Got some handhelds in there. Some uh, Game and Watches. Some Game Boy Colors. Game Boy SP for about 8,800. Got a Game Boy Micro in there for about 14. Shimon Yonsen, some Japan. And uh, Game Boy Color, Atomic Purple there. Zelda Densetsu for the uh, Game Boy. Ninja Gaiden 2. Pokemon Gold, 49.50. Wow. That's a cool little gaming watch there. Bandai. Fighter's History on the Super Famicom. 4,000 yen. Might and Magic for the 3DO. Wow, 4,000 yen for that. We have Dokapon Kingdom for 13,000 yen. It's on the Wii. And Demon Blazin shows up again for 5,500 yen. Got some Nappy Land in there. Some Zelda. We've got a Neo Geo Pocket, the clear blue one, pretty nice looking. One thousand, oh, sorry, 11,000 yen for that. We've got Chip and Dale for the Famicom, 5,500. They've also got uh, Arrow Flash. It's the one that I picked up last time I went hunting with Jim. Very good one for the uh, Mega Drive. Fun game. Really enjoy it. More Game & Watches. They've got Turtles Tournament Fighter for 5,000. Kadesh for 4,400. Gunhead for 4,400. Kai Kai for 7,700 which is not bad considering places everywhere have shot that game price way up. Mega Man 4 in the box for about 5,500. Got Outrun for the Saturn, about 8,000. Silk Rentai for 6,000. These are Sega Saturn games up in here. Lots of cool stuff. We've got Final Fight Guy. I don't know if it comes with uh, it says it's missing the uh, the manual. Final Fight Rising of Red Moon. This is for MSX. 5,000 yen for that. Got Wolverine for the Super Famicom. Got Hedy down there. Biohazard. Zelda. Oh, right in Densetsu. The Mega Drive, Super Metroid, Lupin, lots of good stuff here. Got a gold Nintendo 64, about 13,000. Some handhelds, Monster Hunter version of a 3DS for about 8,800. Please and things. Just the loose Saturn for 6,000. Wow, look at that price on the N64 6,000 loose. I don't think it comes with anything. This uh, Super Famicom here is 6,000. So.
Got a Hori pad in there for about 4,900. Mega Drive 2. Mega Drive 1. Some random games in here. But I think that's going to wrap it up for today's uh, quick uh, live shoot from uh, Akihabara's uh, Hard Off. So stay safe out there. And above all, stay scruffy looking. I'll see you all real soon. If you missed last week, so I'll put it down in the description or at the end screen here. So check it out. Take care, everyone.